Hey guys, welcome to the video today. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to gain access to this compartment in the vacuum here um, so you can empty out all of the garbage and stuff that you have vacuumed up um, and gain access to the filter here in case you need to uh, you know, clean or replace the filter. I'll show you how to clean it um, and if you need to, um, you know, I'll show you how to replace it as well. So. Before I begin, and this is a pretty easy process, but before I begin, if you haven't seen it and you're interested, I do a full review on the This Works uh, corded car vacuum cleaner with accessory kit. I test out the different accessories and show you how well they work. Um, and I'll link that video at the end of this one. So if you're interested and have time, please check that video out. Okay, so the first thing that we wanna do is make sure that we have on the proper safety equipment. I have on a pair of nitrile gloves and safety goggles and a mask. And then the next thing we're going to do is make sure that the vacuum is both off and unplugged before we remove this front part of the vacuum. So the next thing that we're going to do is if you hold on to the front part of the vacuum, this piece here, and then you press down on this button here, it will allow for this piece of the vacuum to disconnect completely. And I'm just going to set that down and then I'll set the other part of the vacuum off to the side. Okay, so now um, we have access to where all the garbage and dust and everything that you have vacuumed up. Um, and the filter is right here. And the first time that you do take this filter out, um, it does say in the owner's manual that it is uh, going to be a little harder. So just keep that in mind. You can see right now how this just comes out really easily. But the first time I did take this out, it did take some extra effort to get it to break loose from, uh, you know, this container here. So if we take the filter out, I'm just going to set that down here. Then you would have access to everything that you vacuumed up and you could, you know, dispose of this. Now for the filter, they do give you this special brush that they include to be able to clean the filter. And this has all the dust and hair and all, all this other dirt and stuff in there. Okay, so, um, you know, it does say too for the filter if it is really dirty. I'm going to show you the instruction manual here. Um, it shows you right here how to maintain a filter. So it says clean it with a special brush when it gets dirty, um, just like I was showing you there. And then for heavy duty dirt, wash it with warm water in addition to the brush. And then it says install a new filter if old one gets damaged. And if you do wash it with warm water, just make sure to let it dry out completely before you put it back into the vacuum. Um, okay, so now we're going to reinstall the filter. And if you needed to, they, they do give you a uh, extra filter when you buy the This Works vacuum. So if you needed to replace it, this would be when you replace it. But this filter has only been used uh, one time so far. So it can only fit in here one way. Um, there's a flat part up here and then it circles down here. And then same thing with the filter. It's flat on this side, then it circles. So it just fits in here the one way. And you just want to make sure that it seats down in there like so. Um, and then we're going to grab the other part of the vacuum. And I'm going to set that down. On the bottom here, there's a, a bump that sticks out. Um, and then on the bottom of this piece here, there's a slot. So we're just going to fit that over um, the bottom like so. And then line it up on top. And once it's lined up, you can press this button down. And then um, it will allow this part to seat back into the vacuum. And then you just want to make sure that it's all the way secure like so. All right, guys. Well, that was it. And I hope this video has been helpful. And thank you so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. Have a good one. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And if you have the time, check out these other great videos.